Hi, I'm Lou with another episode of My Car Story. We're out in Milwaukee at the World of Wheels, and I'm here with Dave. Dave, nice to see you. Hey, Lou, how are you doing? And Dave's got a great car here, and he's a restoring expert, and I'll show you what I mean by that. Let me grab the camera. So, Dave, just show me beforehand what this car originally looked like. And let me start with you. First of all, what's your restoration shop's name? Uh, DMC vehicles. And where are you located? In Butler, Wisconsin, which is a suburb of Milwaukee. Got it. Okay. Show me what this car originally looked like. This 57 Chevy convertible came in like you see it here. It was... Uh, <laughs> you can't even tell it's a 57 Chevy no, convertible. No, it was... It was, it was bar here and everything. Go ahead. Right. He pulled it out of a field, actually. Okay. So this was a field car. Right. Okay. Let's, what do you think? Why don't we show them what the field car has turned into? Okay. All right. Let me, take a look. Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's take right over here at our field car now. And the word after now is wow. This car and the owner who has it, a fantastic choice of original colors. And correct me if I'm wrong, I'm seeing all the options on this car. This car is highly optioned. Just fantastic. What they call this? Surf green, I believe, is the color of this car? Yep. How many man hours, Dave, does it take to make a car look like something pulled from a field? This one here took a little more than, than most. It's probably about 1,500 hours. Fifteen hundred dollars. Wow. And this one is spectacular. Come on back with me. I'm gonna try to get the overall side shot of this car. Let me take one step further back just so I can do that. That's amazing. That's absolutely amazing that this car came from there to here. So when you're restoring a car like this, and I mean, just look at inside the bolts. I mean, it's everything on this car. When you're restoring a car like this, to have all the options. You've got the, the uh, flood, uh, floodlight spotlight mm -hmm. mounted on the outside. This here is called an Autronic uh, 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 light dimmer. And what happens there is if you have your brights on, yeah. it automatically dims your brights as another car approaches. Wow. It's kind of a neat option. That is a neat option. You got the, also the uh, compass, uh, dash compass, which was an option back then. The dash compass right. was an option. I mean, all the jewelry on this car. This is a, a Bel Air, so it's, it's got all the chrome, all the badging. It's got a, uh, that's an original Continental kit. The dual, the dual antennas, antennas, which are, which one is powered. That's, a, that's pretty rare. Uh, it's got the original Continental kit for the, uh, it, it's not an aftermarket, it's an original. Wow. Have you had the chance to drive this car to test it and things like that? Uh, I haven't personally, okay. but uh, it's got the uh, automatic or uh, the three-speed manual overdrive transmission, which is another somewhat rare option. Can you show them where the gas cap is on this. The gas cap is, is in here. <laughs> here, gas locking cap. gas cap. It's another another option. That was a locking gas cap. Yes. Fifty-seven. Yes. So many. A lot of these two were dealer installed options. Yeah. But nevertheless, they were options back you know, then. I've never seen a locking gas cap on a 57. Holy cow. All right. And let's uh, show them how this all works back here. Okay, this. There's a hand. There's a lever back here that this flips forward. So it and then the that trunk. Open and, and the trunk. This. Yes. And the trunk. Uh, I don't have the key. <laughs> all right. We'll get the we'll get the key. I think Ron's yeah. got the key. Yeah. All right, we'll get the key. But you can see how that pulls apart and the gold V in there for the V8. All right, let's shut that. Let's take a look at this interior. I mean, this interior, power windows. This interior looks like a parade. What were some of the diff difficult pieces when you were putting this together? I mean, some of the unique 
touches on this car. Well, you got the power windows, the power seat. Um, gosh. Has a Wonder Bar radio. Uh, it has a a, 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 a vacuum uh, cigarette and ash and vacuum system. There's the Bel Air. Here's the here's the top. Has power top. Uh, has a uh, parking brake sensing light, so the light comes on when you're parking brake. Which is the light right here. Right. And then you've got your wipers, your lights. It also has the automatic uh, um, washing system, which when we look under the hood, you'll see that's a, it's a glass bottle. There's the overdrive. Let me feature that. Now tell me about this. This here is for your cigarettes. Back in the 50s, you know, cigarettes were to let people smoke. And this will suck out the ashes uh, and the smoke. And it goes into a little the glass jar. This ashtray. <laughs> That's kind of what it is, yeah. And then you got wow. your, your fold-out tissue box. Tissue box. You know, there's so many, people would think there's a ton of 57 Chevys out there, but there's very few that have this many options. Right. Yeah, Holy cow. <laughs> Look at the Chevrolet bow tie on there. This is phenomenal. You get the flip here in the mirror right, as well. Right. Oh my gosh, the day night. That's great. All right, let's take a look under the hood. And even I wanted to show the beautiful work here on this hood. Amazing. Of course, this is the dual quad 283, which was uh, somewhat of a rare combination. It also has the, which was really cool, is the HydroVac brake booster. Brake booster. So here, brakes. here you've got your hydro vac braking. Right. It's you kind also of an have version of a hydro boost. Type. You also have power steering connected right. to the back of your. Is this a generator? Or yes, a the generator with the uh, power steering, and you notice the lines go to the hydro vac uh, brake system, which boosts the. Wow. Gives you the power brake feel. What do you got? This here is your automatic windshield washer, which is a glass bottle. <laughs> Just amazing. And then even this, this air cleaner. This, that air cleaner is this, original air cleaner. They call those the bat wing, I right, believe. Right, right. That's an original one that we uh, refurbished. Wow. Those are very expensive options. My goodness. And then this is your heater. Right. And you've also got these vents that come from the Right, this is vents here through the right headlights. Through the, all right, well, let's, uh, let's start her up, shall we? Okay. Light option here, as you can see. Just a little red. Thank you. Wonderful car. I'm sure your owner's got to be absolutely tickled 
And thanks so much for being on my car store and sharing this car with us. Thanks a lot. Thanks for showing it.